are about to have a very transformative experience. I envy you. Call our friend. Tell him to kill the butler. It's no longer necessary. Oswald Cobblepots. Barbara Keen. In my stronghold. Not one step closer, Mr. Velasco. I just had my dear Jongleur with my core relay in his hand and a grenade taped to his mouth. Indeed it is. Huh. Huh. It seems you have the upper hand. Undoubtedly. And now, we have our own demands. Fifty million dollars. That's what you want. It's a nice round number. I don't quite have that on me right now. You gave the mayor six hours to evacuate Gotham. An impossible task. Let him buy another hour. He will save thousands of lives. Fifty million dollars will seem cheap. I see. I play the bill and you get away scot-free and rich. I get you the money. You give me back my core relay. That is usually how a handoff works. Yeah. You drive a hard bargain, but I'll see what I can do. Just like that? After knowing your brother, I expected something more... Insane. Oh, I'm nothing if not sane and reasonable. Two things my brother never valued. That's why I'll be successful where he fails. Well, that and being vastly more intelligent. Now to see about your money. This is Jeremiah Velasca. I'd like to speak to the mayor. I have additional demands. Yes, really. Fifty million unmarked bills. I'll tell you the location. We're not just gonna hand this thing over and let him destroy Gotham, are we? Of course not. Once we get the money, we kill Jeremiah and his people, give the core relay to the police, split the fifty million, and are hailed as the heroes of Gotham. And we cure Butch. And that, certainly. Would you believe it? They put me on hold. Mm. Well. There's always plan number two. Get down! Are you out of your mind? Why do you keep insisting I'm insane? What's insane about having a backup plan? Something Jean-Glaire never knew about. And so, you know, this building is within the blast radius, and because of your interference, I'm gonna detonate the bombs as soon as I'm far enough away to observe the destruction in peace. No, you promised the city six hours! And whose fault is it that I changed my mind? Tell our men to rewire the bombs to work in direct sequence, and the rest of you, kill these idiots.